See, so far I have designed this app as needed. Let's identify the parts we have designed. For that, first I click on Design. I have used four screens for this app. First one is the landing screen. I have added a background color to the landing screen like this. An image has been added to the middle of the screen as image 1. Below that, two text inputs have been added. The name of one of them was given as UID and a placeholder called User ID was given. The name of the other text input was given as PWD and a placeholder was given as password. At the bottom of the screen, two buttons have been added like this. The name of the first button is given as red page and image has been added to the background of the button. In front of that, another button called login has been created and a background image has been added for that too. Next, there is the red screen. A background color has been used for this screen as well. In this way, two labels have been created and user ID and password have been given for the text of those labels. In front of each label, two text inputs were added as set UID and set PWD. Another button was added and the name was given as register. The text of the button is also given as register. Next, there is a voting screen. Three images have been added for the voting screen as image 2, image 3, image 4 in this way. Below each image, three labels have been added as label 1, label 2, label 3. For labels, it is given text as Evelyn, Bob and Raj. Next to each label, three radio buttons have been added as RB underscore can 0, RB underscore can 1 and RB underscore can 2. Also, at the bottom of the screen, a button called Vote button has been created and an image has been added for the background of the button in this way. Finally, there is the result screen. I have added a chart called Chart 1 to the result screen. By clicking on each of these, you can see how other properties have been changed like this. Now, all the work is finished in our design section. 